This morning, fears intensifying of a nuclear catastrophe at Europe's largest power plant after weeks of continued shelling. A Ukrainian military intelligence official tells NBC News Russia told its own Russian employees at the plant to stay home today. The United States condemns in the strongest terms Russia's reckless disregard for nuclear safety and security. NBC News has verified video that appears to show Russian military vehicles inside the plant, though it is unclear when it was taken. It comes amid fierce fighting across Ukraine after Russia occupied the plant earlier this year. Now the two countries trading accusations, ramping up rhetoric and fears that attacks could cause radiation leaks. The Russians accusing Ukrainians of planning a provocation. Ukrainian officials believe that's Russia laying the groundwork to create an incident at the plant and then blame it on Ukraine. The U.N. called for international inspectors to be given access to the plant as concerns grow that a leak of radioactive material could sweep through Europe. We must tell it as it is. Any potential damage to Zaporizhia is suicide. Ukrainians on the ground not taking any chances, conducting response drills, ready for a worst-case scenario. Also new this morning, a Russian foreign ministry official says that they could be ready for inspectors to go inside the plant in September. But Ukrainian officials are warning that they have intelligence right now that suggests that the Russians are actively working to take this plant offline. Tom. All right. Megan Fitzgerald for us this morning. Megan, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.